in terms of San Diego music, I think what you're hinting at is like, is there a genre, you know, like Chicago is very well known for blues and there's also a very strong free jazz scene there. You know, in New York, there's, all, there's several different things. San Francisco has a, I think there's very strong scenes in all of those towns, you know. Los Angeles has a very strong scene. I, I, uh, I really don't like genres and I've never felt like because my music doesn't really fit. You could say the closest thing it would be was jazz, but it doesn't totally fit into jazz, especially not jazz in San Diego. There's a little bit of rock. There's, you know, I grew up listening to heavy metal, things like that. There's all these different things. I, I, I don't like the idea of fusion either, but I feel like, you know, I just create music. Why do you have to put a label on it? Um, I, I, I don't try not to talk about like, well, it's this combination of, you know, funk and swing with a little bit of turmeric and some bar boiled eggs and that doesn't work I you know I just write music but I don't like it, it, people to understand it you know people have to know a genre I remember I used to go to this teriyaki place in Encinitas and we, I was talking to the guy that wrote, worked there and he, he found out I was a musician he said oh what kind of music do you like and he says With, without even letting me respond he says uh, I'm into trance music I, that's the only music he'll listen to and I said, okay, well, that's interesting. I, I play music. I don't really have a, a name for what I do, you know. In some ways, San Diego has so many different things happening. They're all very insular. I wish sometimes it would be a little bit more crossover. But it is nice that each of them are healthy and happening. <laughs> I think most people when they, I mean, this is true in general, when people say San Diego, what do you think? You think the beach, you think, uh, you know, the gas lamp and sort of the, the military aspect of the town. Um, I mean, there is, uh, you know, it was interesting moving to, to Phoenix. Phoenix is very similar in that uh, people really look down on that city, but there's a lot of great artists out there doing a lot of interesting work. Same thing with San Diego, where maybe people don't realize it so much. And people definitely in this town definitely don't realize it. You know, you hear a lot of people saying, oh, I gotta get out of this town, I gotta go here, I gotta go somewhere else. And it's true, I mean, if you want this broader recognition, you know, there's these meccas that you have to go to and everybody knows those spots, you know. Uh, but there's also a lot of work to be done here. You know, I've, I've found it very exciting to not worry about those things and just, work on my stuff. I found that like when I get too much attention, like my work suffers. Not that I want to be in anonymity, not that I don't want people to hear my music, I do want people to hear my music, but I definitely don't, uh, you know, I have no sort of hunger for the spotlight. You know, I'd like to just keep working, have some people hear my music, but not have to deal with uh, all the rigmarole that comes with that. series is called Encinitas and Everything After. It's a five volume work of 25 compositions, uh, five compositions um, on each CD, five CDs. Uh, and it's basically sort of an in-depth look into um, your hometown and uh, how you view the world. Sort of through my eyes, but giving people uh, different ideas of different ways of viewing the world. Um, so you have um, simple looks like the walled garden, which is a little garden that Ruth Larrabee left to the city of Encinitas. You have these massive pieces like Los Patiquitos, which is written dedicated to the lagoon just on the north end of Encinitas. So it gives a pretty wide view of an area that I grew up in and sort of uh, how I view the world.
worse than a lot. <laughs> I mean, I don't, I don't really have a answer. There's so much music out there and there's so much stuff and I find it amazing that anybody has time to listen to my music or any other music. I mean, there's so many things and you imagine how many bands and how many records get put out every day. It kind of boggles the mind. Um, I think I, you know, the way I find uh, my intro to music or how I get into certain things is just to listen to it. Um, sometimes I hate things. Sometimes I hate things for many years. Sometimes I love it immediately and two weeks later I don't like it at all. Um, I have di very different uh, sort of uh, responses to what I listen to. But I always try and listen to things a few times. You know, if I feel that it's important enough that I should listen to it, uh, I listen to it a few times. Uh, the, you know, the first hearing is always interesting. The third hearing is even more interesting. Ten times in, you have a completely different take on what it is. For me, I wish there was a few more performance venues that dealt with music that didn't fit into genres, that kind of went outside of people's comfort zones. Um, but, you know, honestly, San Diego's never really had a strong situation there where there was places like that. So, you know, you, DIY San Diego, that's how it's been <laughs> since I've been doing this. And, uh, you know, I, I know many people have been doing this since the 70s and 80s and putting on music and these kind of spaces. So yeah, clearly there's a lot of growth. There's a lot of great things happening. Um, there's a lot of good people out there. We always need more people. I mean, you saw tonight, Matt Smith's here, David Zakarian's here, there's all these young kids. You know, there's, it's kind of scary when I realize like how many generations there are of, of people that are younger than me that are doing great things. Not scary, scary good. Like, I kind of wonder where the years went. And I'm very excited that like these things, these you know new recruits keep coming in, which I'm very down for.
Oh, 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 oh.